as a part of the pioneering role of the Egyptian media in the Arab and Middle East region, Egypt launched its first satellite channel, broadcasting both in English and French. The channel surprised the Egyptians as well as the Arabs by its form, content, and language. It conveyed its message to the whole world in the main languages understood by everyone. It's Nile TV International. The 10th of October, 1993, witnessed the spark of the launching of Nile TV International. This is Nile TV International, coming to you from Cairo, Egypt. It was the official launching of a great media outlet after five months of pilot transmission. It was a channel that came to light to clarify to the world our true culture that some tried to wipe out. It also worked on introducing the Egyptian viewpoint on most of the Egyptian, Arab and global issues. It went out in October, the month of war and peace for Egyptians, with a wide array of political, economic, tourist, cultural and social programs. The 10th of October 1993 marked the outset of Nile TV International under the leadership of the great media man Hassan Hamid, who was the first to think about launching such a distinguished media outlet under the umbrella of the Radio and Television Union, which in return resulted in a big leap in its production and excellence. Nile TV International is broadcast on three satellites, NileSat, Intelsat and Galaxy, until it became available to most of the countries in the Arab world, Europe, Africa, USA. Owing to its true desire to be up to date with the recent advancement in the social media, Nile TV International has developed its own website and official account on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+, which are operating regularly and professionally thanks to its hardworking and distinguished caliber. A new step forward was taken when Nile TV launched a channel on YouTube whose views has reached million according to the official data which is the largest number of views across the Egyptian radio and television union other YouTube channels Nile TV International has always had an eye on the major international sport it was there to cover all the international and national events Its real start was in the first international conference on population held in Egypt in 1994. Nile TV was there along with the other international news agencies and it succeeded in covering it in a way that impressed everyone. That conference which asserted to the whole world the birth of a new global satellite channel. was also present in most of the famous film festivals, most important of which was Cannes under the leadership of the renowned media man Yusuf Sharif Rizallah, who headed the channel for a long time. <laughs> On the 1st of January 2002, the broadcast of the Hebrew service on Nile TV International started and its transmission reached Israel and most of the world countries in a very clear way. As of the 1st of March 2002, the Hebrew service on Nile TV International became one hour a day and increased for two hours as of the 31st of May 2002. But unfortunately, the broadcast of this service came to a halt for no obvious reason. <laughs> Thank you.
In 2009, Nile TV International was affiliated abruptly to the new sector, which was headed then by Mr. Abdul Latif Manawi, who changed the identity of the channel to be more of a news channel with a variety of distinguished day and evening programs. During the 25th of January and the 30th of June revolution, Nile TV crew was there in all squares and streets to let the Egyptians and the world know the truth of what was happening in every corner of Egypt. It covered closely all the political events which took place in Egypt, especially in critical times. In the aftermath of the January revolution, Egypt suffered from a tourist setback a temporary security vacuum and instability. At that moment, Nile TV International took upon itself the mission of promoting tourism through a variety of tourism programs. Its crew scored the different governorates to clarify the true picture to the West, showing how Egypt was enjoying security and stability once again. <laughs> Owing to Nile TV's great efforts, most of the countries decided to lift the ban on traveling to Egypt. <laughs> Since the 10th of October 1990, the leadership of the channel has been encouraging its staff to create and renovate and for that reason it was always present on the podium with immortal works in spite of the modest available means. Since its inauguration, Nile TV International won many awards. Since the inauguration of Nile TV International, seven highly qualified heads were appointed to preside over the channel till today. Officials and people in charge got to recognize the great role of Nile TV International and the importance of paying it due attention in order to put an end to many problems the state is having with the outer world. Nile TV International is and will always be the voice of love and peace which Egypt conveys to the whole world. <laughs>